Hello everyone, my name is Tan Kai J and I'm from class 4 Orange. Tan Wei Heng is my partner and he's the editor of this video. Today's topic I'm going to be presenting about Mother Nature. Mother Nature. Mother Nature is a personification of nature that focuses on the life giving and nurturing aspects of nature by embodying it in the form of the mother. The point of Mother Nature is respecting nature, protecting environment, urban and rural life, environmental problems, and ECO friendly products, programmers. Next we continue. Respecting nature. Why does nature loss matter? Nature is our life support system. From the fresh air we breathe to the clean water we drink. Nature provides the essentials we all rely on for our survival and well-being and it also holds the key to our prosperity with millions of livelihoods and much of our economic activity also depending on the natural world. This immense benefits to humanity estimated to be worth around 125 trillion USD per year are only possible if we maintain a rich diverse diversity of wildlife. We know what we are losing nature faster than it can restore itself. And without urgent action, significant harm to people and planet is inevitable. In the great food and water of our growing global population, significant harm to our economies and the mass extinction of an ex estimated 1 million species. Protecting environment. Environmental protection implies taking care of and rescuing the environment. First, awareness about environment protection should be spread. The familiar people should know about the need and requirements of the environmental protection. Environmental degradation can be kept under check in some ways. People should be encouraged to plant trees. Trees are our only source of oxygen in the earth. Clearing trees and plants results in depletion and decrease in the amount of oxygen available in the air. This puts the entire humanity at risk. By facilitating the growth of trees, the greenery can be restored. Saving water is yet another effective measure for environment protection. Water is essential for survival. The amount of fresh drinkable water on the earth is very low, less when compared to the enormous population. Water sh should thus be safe. The demand for water increases leaps and bounds, while its supply keeps decreasing. Hence, wastage and excessive use of water should be curtailed. Urban and rural life. As compared to the townspeople, the people in the villages lead attention-free life. There is not much noise in villages. In villages, people generally get fresh vegetables and pure milk. They also consume lesser amount of fast food which is very harmful. There are, however, certain advantages which the urban people have over the villages. There are so much better employment avenues in towns. The security system is also better in towns. In towns, the people often do not feel bored as they have several means of amusement and ex entertainment such as visiting different places of importance. A visit to the zoo, some museum or exhibition, ETC, in towns. People get better education as there are so many schools, colleges, universities and libraries. Better medical facilities are available in towns as there are so many big hospitals and dispensaries that which are not available in villages. In towns, we can have more variety of foods including food and wearing articles. We can get the food of our choice at hotels and restaurants. There are thousands of shops in towns to cater to our needs. Thus, in certain ways, villages are better while in others, towns are better. Nature and environment problems. Environmental problems. Water pollution. Water pollution is any kind of pollutant food in rivers and oceans. 
that contain harmful compounds. Water pollution presents a clear danger to marine life, but it affects all life. Air pollution. Emissions from vehicles and power plants are what come to mind when most people think of air pollution. But methane and other gases from landfills and animal agriculture are significant contributors as well. Beyond climate change, these air pollutants endanger our health. But children and the economically disadvantaged often face the most serious health consequences. Climate change. Climate change causes extreme weather such as heat waves, storms and forest fires. These effects endanger our safety and our economic welfare. In the long term, we will have adverse effects on public health, ecosystems and water and food resources. Deforestation. Deforestation is occurring at an alarming rate all around the globe. The rate of deforestation is due in large part to animal agriculture, mining and drilling. Forests are also being replaced to grow palm oil, a common ingredient in mass produced processed food, soaps and cleaning products. Natural disasters. Natural disasters include hurricanes, flooding, wildfires and drought. The economic costs of these disasters are staggering. These disasters also affect the survival of entire ecosystems and the plants and animals that rely on them. As the world continues to warm, scientists expect the effects and costs to worsen if global warming continues unbated. Eco-friendly products, programmers. Everyone wants to give their family the best whether that means the best food or the highest quality health care. Every parent or guardian is looking to provide their children with the best of the best. When looking into products for families, it is important to consider all of the effects of the products used. How to tell something is eco-friendly? Although many companies and their products promise to be eco-friendly, they can miscontrol their information, leaving consumers confused and often blindly buying their products. When shopping for eco-friendly products, look for Energy Star for appliances and electronics that are energy saving, USDA Organic Seal for cosmetics and foods that truly are organic, Green Seal for cleaning products that are safe for the environment, Forest Starship Council logo for paper and wood products. This is the end of our presentation. Thanks for watching.